Dear colleagues, this patient underwent manual small incision cataract surgery by my colleague three weeks ago. Now she has come with loss of vision, pain, redness. On examination, we can see hypopion and eye well is not visible. A thick white sheet is covering the intraocular lens. Now I have planned antechamber lavas in this patient with injection of moxifloxacin into the antechamber. I have opened the side port that was used for SICS. Now I have taken a 22 gauge Simcoe cannula and I am entering into the entry chamber. Now I start aspirating the hypopion, the pus that was settled at 6 o'clock. Now I remove the fibrinous strands from the entry chamber. Now the thick epithelium sheet of inflammatory membrane that was covering the intraocular lens is coming out now. Yes, here it is. It has come out and now we can see red glow and the intraocular lens very clearly. So this is a nice lavage and in any postoperative inflammation we can give antechamber lavas in this way. It decreases the inflammatory load that you will have to cover with steroids. Now I am going behind the intraocular lens into the bag and this inflammatory strands that are uh, that was there is removed. Now I am going into the equator of the bag and I am removing this rope like inflammatory strands. That's it. The eye well has been studded with inflammatory cells. I have polished a part of it. That's it. This is the lavage. Now I am going to inject intracameral moxifloxacin in this case. And I am going to use the moxifloxacin to hydrate this side port. Here it is. Moxifloxacin is being used to hydrate the side port. And now this moxifloxacin is being injected into the anterior chamber. And after this, after injecting moxifloxacin into the anterior chamber, I injected dexamethasone subconjunctively at two points and that concluded the surgery. Thank you very much for watching.